Once upon a time, there were two twin sisters, Zora and Yaga. It was well past curfew. My sister sneaked out of the village. I followed her, as I always did. I took my bow. make arrows myself. This time wasn't any different. All I needed was some sticks and feathers. And a bit of work to put them together. Zora is always up to something. Can you see it? See what? The tree. The red oak. The red oak. We've often used it for target practice. Head straight to the red oak. I will meet you there. Uh, Zora? Was it you? Can't stand a second without a leash around your neck. How about you finally go down your own path? I... I, I never wanted to harm anyone. I still don't want to. I always try to do what's right. Trying is all you could ever do. <laughs> you got it all wrong. Once upon a time, there was a freak with no face. Ooh, How much longer you want to be a nobody? You just follow in your sister's footsteps. How far will you go when she's not around? Zora's got a, a plan. She always has one. It's time you had a fucking plan. You want to hide here in the woods? You can't hide from Baba, princess. I, I just need to find the red oak. The red oak. <laughs> if anything bad happens... Stop it! Then forget the goddamn oak! Is it drilling into your little head? The hut. The hut! Just another bad dream. I haven't had a good night's sleep since Laura went missing. First, I have to get some food to get my strength back. I have to go hunting to get some meat first. I keep having nightmares since...
Baba the Witch started snatching kids from the village. Volko, Savitza, Draggery. Weavers of life keep on spinning their thread. That's my good deed for the day. Oh, it's a big one. I hope I can take it down. village. I can't go back. Not without Zora. He's tough. It'll need more than one shot. A bite from that spider can kill in seconds. I'd better fix myself an antidote. Just in case. Monsters trap birds just for fun. I can try to force them out then.
Your blood won't go to waste. It shall flow through my heart forever now, because we are one. Now meat goes over the fire. I'm hungry. People have always accused me of helping Baba, called me a, a freak. And Zora disappeared too, there was nobody left to keep the angry mob away. So, here I am. Finding my sister is my only option now. I need to get to the Red Oak. sister. Wait. Was that a ghost? What the hell is wrong with this forest? ago, the same that haunts my every dream. <sighs> I'll just sneak a peek, look for any sign of Zora. Bow before the master of the house. They're hissing, huh? Mask. It's trembling.
It's... It's you! Again. But... This is not a dream. Well, shit. It fucking isn't. Surprised? Don't you remember all the times I saved your ass before? I... What do you... Better get used to it. This time I'm gonna stay for a good while, princess. I'll also help you get out of this shit you're in. Um... <sighs> the roots have overgrown this place. Ugh. We'll deal with it. Oh... Is this... The one who watches over the world. But look what's happened to him. And to the world. Let him feed off of what you've brought. Press the seal. The seal? Your mask. Damn kids always get their crumbs in the yard. <laughs> Whoa. Not bad. has been full on the base lately. So you're gonna stand here forever now? I could try jumping over. <gasps> no. Figure out something that makes sense. That's what I call a good winter. Mm. Mm. Giant mushrooms? I heard about you in old folk tales. Never thought you'd turn out to be real, though. What are you... Oh! Oh, shoot. A human girl. And she's holding a bow. Should we? Wait. This mask on her face. Don't know why exactly, but it makes her look almost familiar. Not many of your kind coming here. Have you lost your way, girl? Oh, I like her bow. It's such a nice bow. Uh, can I touch it? Did she come alone? Uh, where's Keep she? Keep it down, kids. Can't you see the grown-ups are talking? I'm... I'm looking for someone. And, well, the trail goes over the broken bridge, so... See, Borvi? The bridge is broken! It must have been the fire drake that burnt it. You mean a dragon? A vile, bloodthirsty reptile? No way you've got a real one here. Of course we haven't. A dragon just happens to be the best cover-up for whoever's behind that honey hustle. Anyway, they call me Borvi Borko. Slippery Jack at your service. My name's Yaga. What kind of name is that? <laughs> What's that short for? Quit your jabbering. I can't hear what she's saying. Would you... Would you happen to know another way across the river? Oh, there is no other way, I'm afraid. We could rebuild the bridge for you, but... Or rather have a bunch of beavers do it for us. Yeah, we sure could do this. But we need to take care of the fire drake first. <sighs> it 
It seems you've got a really burning issue here with the beast on your shoulders. But I really need to get across the bridge. So maybe we can help each other out? You seem like a crafty lass. Help us get rid of the beast, and we'll get the bridge fixed for you. Well, I'm not exactly a dragon slaying type. Oh, I'm sure you'll do just fine. Go find Rebel, a rather peculiar cursed type. He's a friendly face, even if it's a bit hard to tell. <laughs> He'll tell you what's what. Dragon or not, this thing needs to be taken care of. But you should start by finding my friend, the Noble Grand Knight. And get yourself a good luck charm, such as... a horseshoe. <laughs> In any case, you should follow the dragon's roar. The roar? <laughs> Just go to the caves west from here. All right. I'll see what I can do. Off to a great adventure I am. <laughs> It can save your sorry ass. You gotta learn every way to crawl out of your own grave. Oh, no point. Try something else. Miss, uh, moment of your time. Oh, uh, good day to you, Mr... Mr. Lava. Not a very good day to be alive, I gotta say. All underworlds are rage. Beholders protesting, lost souls reading around, and made tunnels blocked by those awful roots. Gotta dig the terrace. It's got me all twisted. Tell me, miss. Did I go up or did I go down? You must have gone up to get here, Mr. Lava. Oh, yes, that's so. Thank you, miss. I should get back to work. The monsters aren't going to make themselves, are they? Try finding yourself first. Fish. I should make myself a fishing rod one day. I was here, like... It's been a year now. Painful memories. Good. Pain means you're not there. Yet.
Hmm. In the old ritual statue. We spilled those to ward off the winter. Days of yore. Before our might, puny mortal, soon the rivers will flow with the blood of all who dare to oppose the eternal empire of ants. I... I beg your mercy, my Queen Empress. Enough! Show me the way to the human settlement, so I can lead my merciless army and pour my wrath upon them. Lead your armies past the lake, my queen. May your conquest be swift. Soon, all will know the true meaning of horror. Fancy a chat, girl?
May your hand be just, but your she is patient. Finders keepers. You can brew. Interesting to see out of it back of us. And finally become a hero in your own story. <laughs> stories it turns into plain wood at full moon everyone can be turned into a resource like the noose didn't hold you tight enough, huh? <laughs> not tight enough and not long enough. Nothing can hold me, girl. You must be Jack's friend. He sent me to help you get rid of- The dragon? Ha! <laughs> Good old slippery Jack. Always the best in bending the truth. The dragon, as well as his famous appetite for honey, is just a fraud. The honey itself is a real beast here. It's what's making folks madder than a wet hen cloud their minds. I can see each of you has this whole thing figured out differently. How about you get your story straight if I'm to help you? Woohoo! That's the spirit! I love it! Rage on, burn through! You're exactly who I need right now. <sighs> can we stop beating around the bush then? Ha! That's what I like to hear! Listen, there's a will-o'-wisp den nearby. The critter's been holding heaps of honey in there. I'm about to build this thing, Majiggy, to turn their cave into a cave and if you catch my drift. Their nest goes boom! We get rid of the bugs, and what's more important, of the honey. We're not letting it put us in irons, turn us into mindless slaves. But, first things first, we need the plans for the damn, uh, Thingy. That's one solid plan. It seems I'm not getting across the bridge anytime soon. Relax. I got people in places. <laughs> They'll help the geezers with your bridge. If you help me. So yeah, the plans. You gotta snatch them from Matt's castle. Bovi Boko's friend? Why don't you go get the plans yourself? A cursed free bird like me? Nah, I can't stomach even a minute round them holier-than-thou grand posers. I'm allergic to their BS. All right, all right, all right, all right. Any more questions on the job, or are we ready for some honey flavor? All right, then. I guess it's time to get my hands dirty. Or sticky, for that matter. Music to my ears. Now. Meet me at my place as soon as you got it. Anything wrong? Can't you hear it? Some vermin coming this way. Don't have too much fun. <laughs> <sighs> there 
are too many of them. This thing stuck on my hand. You've ever... figured it out at last. That fancy gauntlet of yours. Learn, act, repeat. I'll try. Now, make it special. Boost your shot with this energy. No, make it special. Getting somewhere. Now, what was it the mushroom wanted? <laughs> oh, make a wish upon a fucking shooting star. Weapons of war for our enemies to scour in fear. I'm afraid I'm no blacksmith, your highness. A bow and some arrows is all I've got. Arrows! A strategic resource for the conquest. Bring me five arrows, and the Empire of Ants will annihilate all- I shall prepare the offering in no time, your highness. Hmm. We need weapons of war. I'm afraid- Arrows! A strategic resource for the conquest. I shall prepare the off- mm. We need- we I'm afraid- May the Legion of the- This shall not go-
Hi, miss. Fancy seeing you again. Miss, I'll be honest with you. If I don't get sticks and stones to break old bone... Y yeah. It so happens I might just have some top-tier quality... Thank you so much for your good deed, miss. Feels good to help. Are we done here? Oh, gracious one. The darker the night, the brighter the stars. Out with a bang. Go ahead. Hmm. <laughs> For my little guests, 
I showed my tricks. They won't doubt the recipe. If I bake them, so, so sweet. I know who you are, you filthy wretch! Rebels sent you to steal my plans, didn't he? I may not have regained my full strength after the winter, but it'll be more than enough for a maggot like you! On guard! I uh, weed orphans all the same! Who's? Oh, oh, I don't. I can't. I can't. Is, is that? Is it you? It is. It's really, really you. Oh, I've been waiting for so long, and now all my prayers have been answered. Wait, the mushroom here, he... Oh, oh, he's dead! <laughs> uh, excuse me? I mean, he'll grow back, but then you can make him dead again. Woohoo! The dragon is safe now. We can have it. Stupid roots ain't gonna hold us back. Mm-hmm. Right. Please, accept this jar of honey. Take it to the dragon's lair, when the dragon sticks out its head, grab it, pull it out, and fly it back home! Hmm. Okay. Yes! <laughs> to the dragon's den, then. Oh, come see me at my place when you got it. I can hardly wait! <laughs>
Your blood won't go to waste. Well done, that's the right place, right time. Keep quiet. <laughs> How nice. Someone came to dinner. Too bad he didn't give us a chance to tidy up the place first. So much dirt everywhere. I guess we need to at least sweep the floors. <sighs> what is this? Get over here, you little piece of shit. I feel sick. I need a cure.
Now you get the idea. Feels good to help. Are we done here? Oh, gracious one. May your hand be just, but your she is patient. Spit it out already. But we've never met. Uh, he thinks you're her. She must have been here. Zora, do you know where she... Uh, where I went when we met last time? Some of us die for nothing. Some of us live for nothing. of war for I I'm afraid I'm no blacks Arab may the lead this so this must be the dragon's den time to drop the lure somewhere around now for some hiding spot See what happens.
What? Who's that? Mm. Hey, there's one. Are you looking for something here? Oh, um, me? Why would I look for honey? I, I don't even like honey. I never said you were looking for honey. Neither did I. Listen, kid. My name's Twig. What are you really doing here, Twig? I'm... Uh, uh, trying to save Blossom, my sister. The dragon got her. She's in the cave. You gotta help me. Dragon, huh? Well, I might as well take a look inside. You sure? She went this way. What's that noise? Well, the terrible dragon, of course. Just a little bit further. Did she really go there? She sure did. You have to jump down now. Jump down? There? <laughs> I can't believe you fell for that. You're not the only one. Twig, I'll get you for this. <laughs> oh, you're not going anywhere. 